What's up guys, in this video I'm going to give you an update on this snippet ban. So in December or November last year when Google rolled out its sort of end of year Google Core update, a lot of people noticed that they were losing their snippets. They got literally no snippets across their entire website and it was kind of hypothesized or agreed upon by most people that there seems to be something in the Google algorithm where we can get completely banned from getting snippets so an entire website doesn't get any snippets at all. This isn't just losing one or two snippets here and there. It is a website with hundreds of articles on it being unable to get any snippets whatsoever. In my previous video, I showed you how to check that with SEM Rush. We found that most people who got this snippet ban lost around about 20% of their traffic. Subsequently, Google came out and denied that they had done anything in their algorithm that would cause this snippet ban to happen. They say there's no such thing as a snippet ban, and yet hundreds of people all over the web, on Reddit, on YouTube, everywhere, are saying, why have I got no more snippets after the December update? I personally lost about 20% of my traffic and about 20% of my revenue for one of my websites. But the good news is I did get my snippets back in the current Google update. Now, not everyone got their snippets back. In fact, a lot of people lost their snippets in this update. But the good news is there seems to be a sign that you can get your snippets back if you've lost them, right? If, if you lose your snippets in this core update, like I did in the previous one, there is a possibility, I'm not saying it's a likelihood, but it is a possibility that just like me, you will get your snippets back in the following core update. So I don't know why, I'm not even gonna have a guess why Google is doing this, but I did win my snippets back and if you recently lost your snippets, you may still be able to win them back. So what did I do? I did absolutely nothing. My theory has been that this is Google's problem. Google has done something in their algorithm to cause us to lose snippets either uh, intentionally or unintentionally. And I was just gonna say, look, I'm just gonna wait for Google to fix it. And it did end up getting fixed. So here's the evidence here after the Google Core update. Um, I now have 1.74% of my ranking keywords have got snippets. Something that I found really interesting though, is that you can rank a website still without snippets. My website did pretty well without snippets. And in fact, just had its best month last month you're just around about 20% less traffic. So you need to factor that in say, well, if I was getting you know 200 page views per article before, now I'm only gonna be getting 160 page views per article on average, because I'm gonna have a 20% less effective hit rate, right? So it is upsetting, it, it doesn't, it's not great, but you can still do well, you can still make a good website without Google snippets. So I'll just show you sort of the life, lifespan of this site to give you a bit of an example. So here we are uh, toward the end of last year. This is when I got hit with the Google update. So Google update hit and for some reason, uh, there was a week there where I was down like 40% and then I recovered a little bit. And in the end, I ended up being down around about 15 to 20%, right? And that's kind of where I stabilized. Here in the middle is Christmas. My website just went totally quiet over Christmas, which is common in many niches. And then I started to recover. Around about this point here where I've got the arrow, I got one of my, well, I got my VA to upload a backlog of articles. I'd gotten my writers to write about 200 articles and they were just backlogged. They were all just stacked up um, and I just didn't have anyone who was able to upload them and format them for me. So I hired a VA right here and I uploaded 200 new articles on the site. And you can see all through this period where there is no snippet. There is no snippet at all for the whole website all through this period. And the, the website still grew and grew and grew to the point where two weeks ago before the Google update, the site was getting the most traffic it had ever gotten, showing that you can still have a successful website even without any Google snippets, which is great news for people who are freaking out right now saying, well, you know, I've got no snippets, I'm upset. Well, look, you, you can still persevere. If you still think it's a worthwhile site, you know, keep persevering. You may still be able to have a great site just without any feature snippets, right? And then um, the update rolled out. I got a bit of a spike. And then um, you can see here, I think it's gonna stabilize around right about where it was yesterday and the day before. So it's plus maybe 20 to 25% at the moment. So essentially, if we were to draw a straight line from the previous update to, uh, so the update where I lost my snippets to now, 
you would have expected my site to be getting traffic up here, right? Up a little bit higher as it kind of slowly grew. But I was a bit, my site's traffic was a bit depressed for about three months in between the two updates. So let's summarize this. Two things that I think are really important takeaways, especially for people who lost their snippets in the May core update. Number one, you can still have a successful site without snippets. Expect a little about a 20% or 15% less click-through rate to your articles, meaning you need to factor in the fact that every article you publish now, you know, if it was making just just for clarity's sake, uh, $10 per article, now it would probably just be making $8 per article, right? So anticipate around about 20% less return over the short term while you don't have your snippets. And the second key takeaway is you may still be able to win your snippets back in future core updates, um, just like it happened to me. I'm not promising it's gonna happen to you, but it may happen.